All right, let us quickly solve this Olympiad mass problem. Okay, we are given that 2 raised to the power a plus 4 raised to the power b plus 8 raised to the power c is equal to 148. Then we should find a, b, and c. All right, now the first thing we do is to break down 4 and 8. So this is um, 2 raised to the power a, okay, plus 2 raised to the power 2, all brackets a, okay, plus 2 raised to the power 3. All bracket C is equal to 148. So I'm going to have that this is 2 raised to power A plus 2 raised to power 2A plus 2 raised to power 3C is equal to 148. So what do we have now? Now let us factor out 2 raised to power A. If I factor out 2 raised to power A, I'll be left with 2 raised to power A divided by that 2 raised to power A I factored out plus 2 raised to power 2A, 2B, sorry. This is B, not A. Sorry, this is B. So 2 raised to power 2B divided by 2 raised to power A, okay? Plus 2 raised to power 3C divided by 2 raised to power 1, A, okay? That's how to factorize 148. So now, let us apply indices 2 raised to power A into. Now you know that when something divides itself, the answer is 1. Then plus, this one is going to be 2 raised to power 2B minus A. Why? Because a uh, lot of indices say that if the base are the same thing, we should take one of them, one of the base, then we should subtract the power if we have divide. Okay? So plus the same thing here. Because we have divide, we are going to subtract again 2 raised to the power 3c minus a. Okay? Uh -huh, is equal to 148. Now, you should observe that that um, this first one here, this 2 raised to the power a is an even number. Why this one here is an odd number? How did I know? 2 raised to the power any, any number is what? An even, except 0. Uh, 2 raised to the power 0. Aside 0, 2 raised to the power any number is an even number, okay? So now, now 2 raised to the power the same any number is an even number, right? Uh -huh. Plus another even number will give you even. So 2 even will give plus 1 must give you an odd number. Okay, check it out. So this one is an odd number. Why this one is what? An even number. Now, the question is, can you turn 148 in terms of even and odd? Let us check it out. So you say 148, 2 divide 74, 2 divide 36, uh, 37, right? Yes, 37. 37 divide 1. Now, this is 4 times 37. So 4 is an even number and 37 is an odd number. So we are going to use that. So this is now... This is now 2 raised to the power a into 1 plus 2 raised to the power 2b minus a plus 2 raised to the power 3c minus a okay, is equal to 4 times 37. So now what we do here is we equate even to even and then odd to odd. So which means 2 raised to the power a is equal to, two, uh, is equal to 4. Okay? And this one that is odd which is 1 plus 2 raised to the power 2b minus a plus 2 raised to the power 3c minus a is equal to what? 37, which is an odd. Okay? So break this 4 down. We have that 2 raised to the power a is equal to 2 raised to the power 2. So if the base cancel out, therefore my a is equal to what? 2. So if my a is equal to 2, let us solve here now. This one can go here to have that 2 raised to the power 2b minus 2 because my a is 2 plus. 2 raised to the power 3c minus 2 is equal to what? 30, 36, or rather, 37 minus 1. 37 minus 1, because this one came here to become minus 1. So this is now 2 raised to the power 2b minus 2 plus 2 raised to the power 3c minus 2 is equal to 36. Now, let us repeat the same thing we did before. Let us factor out this first person. If I bring out this first person, which is 2 raised to the power 2b, minus 2. I'm going to be having 2 raised to the power 2b minus 2 over the same thing I factored out. 2 raised to the power 2b minus 2. Okay? Plus 2 raised to the power 3c minus 2 all over the same thing I factored out. 2 raised to the power 2b minus 2. Okay? So is equal to what? 36. So this is now 2 raised to the power 2b minus 2 into now when something divides itself is 1 Plus, this is 2 raised to the power 3c 
minus 2 minus into 2b minus 2. Because according to the law of indices, if the base are the same thing, we should subtract the power when we have divide. Okay? So is it what to what 36? Now, let us see again. 2 raised power anything again, like I told you, is an even number. So this man is even. Okay? Now, this is an even again. Even plus 1 must give you odd. So can we express 36 as an even and odd number? So let's see. 36, 2 divide 18, 2 divide 9, 9 divide 1. So which is 4 times 9. So 4 is an even number. Why 9 is an odd number? So we're going to have it to be 2 raised to power 2b, uh, 2 raised to power 2b minus 2 uh, multiplied by 1 plus 2 raised to power uh, 3c minus 2 minus 2b plus 2. If you clear bracket, minus times this will give you minus this. Minus times minus will give you plus this. Okay? Is it what to what? Now, we express this as 4 times 9. Okay? So now, even we equate even, why odd? We equate odd. So I'm going to have that 2 raised to power 2b minus 2 is equal to 4. While 1 plus 2 raised to power 3c minus 2 plus 2 is gone. So I'm left with 3c minus 2b. Okay? Is equal to 9. So I'm going to have that, break, break this down, I'm going to have that 2 raised to power 2b minus 2 is equal to what? 2 raised to power 4. So if the base cancel out, I'm going to have that 2b minus 2 is equal to, what? sorry, 2 raised to power 2, not 2 raised to power 4. 2 raised to power 2, okay? Is equal to 2. So this one coming here, I'm going to have that 2b is equal to 2 plus 2. So 2b is equal to 4. Therefore, my b is equal to 4 divided by 2, which is 2, okay? So this is my b now. Now, solving this side, let me take this to this side to have that 2 raised to power 3c, 2 raised to power 3c, uh, 2 raised to power 3c minus 2b is equal to 9. This one moving here, I'm going to have minus 1. So 2 raised to power 3c minus 2, my b is to 2 into 2, is equal to what? 8. So 2 raised to power 3c minus 4 is equal to what? 2 raised to power 3. So if the base take care of the base, I'm going to have that 3c, 3c minus 4 is equal to 3. So uh, permit me to finish it up here. So I have that 3c minus 4 is equal to what? 3. So 3c, 3c minus 4 is equal to 3. So to show that what? That 3c is equal to 3 plus 4. So 3c is equal to 7 y c will now be 7 over 3. So we have gotten that our a is 2 and our b is 2 while our c is 7 over 3. So let us check if uh, this is correct. Okay. So the question say that to check, check, the question say that 2 raised to power a plus 4 raised to power b plus 8 raised to power c gave us um, 148. Okay, so let us check if this side will give us 148. So this is 2 raised to power 2 plus 4 raised to power 2 plus 8 raised to power 7 over 8. Am I going to get 148? Let us check. Sorry, 7 over 3, not 7 over 8. So this is, this raised to power, this is 4. Plus, this raised to power, this is 16. Plus, now this is 2 raised to power 3. All raised to power 7 over 3. So if this comes to this, I'm going to have 2 raised to power 7. Okay, 2 raised to power 7. 2 raised to power 7. That is, this is 4 plus 1, uh, 16 plus 128. 2 raised to power 7, 128. Now let us check. Plus 16 plus 4. That is 148. So 148 is equal to 148. So it's very correct. So thank you very much for watching this video. Please don't forget to like this video, share, and then subscribe to our channel. So that is that for that. Okay, it's a very simple uh, arithmetic. So the only concept you should always remember is that we factor out the first one and then we put it in terms of even and odd. Put the left hand side in terms of even and odd. Put the right hand side in terms of even and odd and you put it and then you get your answer. Right? So if you have any question, you can drop it in the comment section. Bye-bye.